A very good afternoon and welcome to the Ecogen Stadium at Steer Park on a very, very special occasion. The testimonial for Grant Gallagher and Scott Robertson, long-serving players for Stranra. I'm Lawrence Nelson, delighted to be here. Brian Martin is alongside me. George Frank is on the camera. Brian, this is a special day. It certainly is, Lawrence. I thought it was going to be hellish weather-wise, but uh, it's windy, but it's nice and dry at the moment anyway. So today features Gal and Robo's 11 against the Stranra Legends. Do you want to bring us the line-up for Gal and Robo's 11 yeah. today, uh, Brian? See, this is a special occasion, Lawrence. I've, uh, I've wrote a poem for the, for the boys before I read it to the team, so hopefully we're not doing any outtakes for this. Now, here we go. Now it's Robo and Gal's big day, but where are they really fae? The pair were born in Irvin, not a million miles from Garvin, but the boys are great, so I would say... A lovely geographical tour at Ayrshire there. Well done. Thank you very much, Lawrence. Checks in the post, is it? No, no <laughs> chance. Right, here's the team. Garland, Robo, <coughs> 11. He's number one, Davy Mitchell. Two is Scott Robertson. Three, Craig Pettigrew. Four, Scott Rumsby. Five, Frank McEwen. Six, Stephen Bell. Seven, Andy Starlin. Eight, Grant Gallagher. Nine, Craig Malcolm. Ten, Ryan Thompson. And 11 is Wally Gibson. On the bench for the Garland, Robo, 11 is... 12, Mark Doherty. 13, Andy Down, who's a goal goalkeeper. 16, Declan Gallagher. 17, Chris Aitken. 18, Sean Winter. 19, David McKenna. And 20, Grant Greg Gallagher, sorry. Nearly gave two grants there. <coughs> so the Stranraer Legends 11 in goals. Number one, Aidan Russell. Number two, Lee Sharp. Number three, Danny Mitchell. Four, Murray Henderson. Five, Dixie Wingate. Six, Alan Jenkins. Seven, Grant Anderson. Eight, Scott Agnew. Nine, Michael Moore. Ten, David Graham. And 11, Ryan Wallace. On the bench for the Legends, number 12, Ian Aldred. Subkeeper, 13, Eric Phillips. 14, Daryl Duffy. Calm down, Brian. Number 15 is Kyle Turner. Yay! 16, Paul Woods. Now, number 17 in the past, many of you would have read Chairman Ian Dugan's page in the Bandstand Match Day pro programme. Ian regularly signed his piece off with Ali Le Bleu, but today we see Bienvenue à un vrai bleu de Stranra, le seul et unique Armand Oni. For Absolutely. viewers in Lanarkshire, that's the one and only Armand Oni. Absolutely agree with that. 18, Ryan Edgar. 19, Robert Love. And 20, Jinky Hilton. Now, change to the referee for today. We understand the referee for this one is Ryan Kyle. Uh, late call-offs due to the weather. <laughs> the legends are in white. Gallon Robo's 11 fittingly in blue. There'll be a few familiar places to a lot of people and a few maybe not so familiar. It depends how long you've been supporting Stranraer and the Guard of Honour lines up. <laughs> so fittingly, Robo wearing number two, Gal wearing number eight. Their squad numbers for Strana. The two of them, of course, still playing. Um, the two managers either side, Stevie Aiken and Stevie Farrell. Both yeah. former Strana managers and actually they teamed up together because um, Stevie right. Farrell was Gingy's yeah, assistant right, when he was the manager. And then Steve got the job here, didn't he? Scott Rumsby there, number eight, of course, is Grant Gallagher. He's yeah. easy to pick out. There's <laughs> Wally Gibson, Brian. Michael Moore gave him a bit of push there right away, Gallagher. So he can be <laughs> Is there a, a team that you think should be favourites here, Brian? Well, should I, suppose it be the team team? We, I suppose a team with Wally, Wally Gibson could, could be favourites, couldn't they? Well, I'm thinking the blue team in general are probably yeah. more recent players. Yeah, yeah. That's right. Um, whereas the Strana Legends, the white team, are, are guys that, you know, they're legends because they played back in the day. Yeah, that's um, true, I suppose. Yeah. And, of course, it depends what these guys are doing in their day-to-day -day <laughs> jobs, if they're keeping it fit. It really is quite surreal watching them. <laughs> <laughs> Sharpie getting a touch there. Uh, here's Alan Jenkins on the ball, 18 in the middle. Sends it away out to the left. Now, there's Murray Henderson, Murray. again, one of Neil Watt and Stuart Miller's team. Derek Wingate was the, the captain at that point. I think Murray stays in Muller all these days. I've not, I've not met him in Costa yet, Lawrence, so I'll have to try and <laughs> arrange it. Now, is Michael Moore yeah. in here? Oh, I think the line was up behind play, right enough. Oh, and it's Davy Graham. Yeah. Ah, oh. and that's a shot in from... Grant Anderson, Grant Anderson it was, yeah, yeah. wasn't far away. I think the line will keep up with play here, Lawrence. He was uh, 
Well behind there. <laughs> Is this Andy Downey coming on? Oh, there we go. Well, I think David Mitchell well, wasn't David's fit. Well, David's carrying an orc, isn't he? Yeah. Right? Yeah, so fair play. David Mitchell came, made a, yeah, a, a, a token appearance. appearance. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, Andy Downey comes on to yeah. replace him. Yeah. So Mitchell David gets a Mitchell. couple of minutes. Just a wee bit with David Mitchell. Made, he made 204 appearances uh, for May United in loan initially. And then he went to Dundee, Falk at Clyde, Hibbs, and at where he is now, Patrick Thistle. Of course, he's 34, he's still playing as Mitch. Yeah, yeah, he certainly is. And he still and certainly does still play, so, you know, there should be a difference with players like yeah. that. Who was that? Belly, was it? I don't think the heavy pitch might... Uh... <laughs> Willie Gibson. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for Pettigrew. <laughs> <laughs> now, Gibson to Craig Pettigrew into the box, and it's booted clear. There's Scott Agnew. Nice to see him back yeah, at Steel Park. No, yeah. that was a nice ball forward. Oh, I thought you guys chipped the keeper there. So Aggie front. plays it out to the left. I think that'll be Lee Sharp over there, yeah, is it? Yeah, certainly is. Get to Davy Graham up on that far side. Inside to Ryan Wallace. Into the box. Where's the linesman going? <laughs> the line is just out for the day. <laughs> he's, he's getting abuse. He's certainly not what we play the linesman, that we can see. <laughs> I mean, it's quite hard to see another testimonial here, Lawrence. That's 40 years ago. That's so, what I was saying you know to Robo I mean? when I was he, speaking to him yeah, now. These guys are just getting short contracts every year, you know. Yeah, that's what Robo was saying. He says, nowadays it's a, you know, he says, I don't think yeah. I've ever had more than a one year contract yeah. at Sunra. Yeah. Now, here come the, the blue team. Oh. Stevie, Stevie Bell, Bell has a pop, and he ain't far away, Stephen Bell. Stephen Bell was with Stranraer from 2013 to 2018, and he was one of the team that was League One runners-up back in 2014 to 15. We can't say the keeper for the Stranraer legend is, is Aidan Russell, who I think he, he, he comes out with the team. Yeah, he helps with the goalkeeping, games, yeah. I think, now. Yeah. So in that respect, he's a legend. He, yeah. he, he works hard for us. Ryan Thompson onto that ball from Andy Sterling. Sterling, he's going to have a go, and it's and here's Craig Malcolm. Oh, oh and that's oh, a see. great save by yeah, Aidan Russell to deny nice. Craig Malcolm. Sign him up, Tiff. 13 minutes in, <laughs> lovely save from Aidan Russell. Malcolm made 279 appearances for us and scored 106 times. Turns, plays Sterling back in, crosses into the box. Sharp gets a header on it, but it's still there, oh, and yeah. Scott Robertson Robert. ain't far away. 14th minute, Robbo almost scores in his own testimonial. And Michael Moore has had enough. Michael goes off to be replaced by Robert Love. Any of the younger viewers, Michael Moore made 290 appearances for Stranraer and he scored 94 times. Known at the time and still as Mr Stranraer. Well known for the use of his elbow, shall we yeah, say. Yeah. Henderson, now that's a decent ball out to Grant Anderson on the right. Danny Mitchell. Nice from Danny Mitchell. Oh, oh lovely running. Here is Mitchell. He's, yeah. he's come forward for that. And that is going to be the first yeah. goal of the afternoon. 20 minutes in. Danny Mitchell. Danny Mitchell scores for the Legends. Nicely taken. And uh, Mitchell did well. Started the move and finished the move. Yeah, it was a lovely move, lovely running through. I think they didn't follow the, the, the runner right. They didn't, the no, no. On, but, uh, <laughs> Danny Mitchell, he made uh, 168 appearances for his lawns. He scored 16 times uh, and he was signed from Northampton. Northampton, Northampton yeah. Town. He also played for Annan, Glen Afton, Halford and he finished up his career at Creighton. Armand Oney has arrived in the park down at the sidelines there talking to Robert Rice. And it's uh, Declan Gallagher and David McKenna coming on. And it's Franco, is it? And Malky. Thank you, Malky. I um, think Mal Malky had a late fitness test before he could play. The, the group of players assembled today includes five former and current Stranra managers, eight players who have won a league title with Stranra, 17 players who have been league runners up with Stranra, and one player who's gone on to be capped by Scotland after playing for Stranra. And he's just come on, that's Declan Gallagher. 
It's got a new... I think he's on, is it? Well, it's being played on. And he misses. Ryan Wallace with a goal at his mercy. I don't think Andy Downey could have done much about that, but he misses. Whether he was onside or not, I'm not entirely sure. But uh, he was allowed to play on. Now, Mark Doherty yep, is Spark about to come on. Sparky. Sparky. Craig Inside. Pettigrew replaced by Mark Doherty. And it comes. Oof. Oh. And Gally ain't far away with that one. First time attempt at the ball. And uh, Seals probably a foot over the bar. Willie Gibson played 98 times for us and scored 25. It's not a bad uh, yeah, return. One, one a goal in one and four pretty much, yeah. yep. This line who keeps on putting his flag up, Lonzo. I'm, uh, he's, con he's I'm confused. He seems to have given up all attempts to follow yeah, the yeah, game, the linesman. He's kind of just talking away to the... Yeah. The, one on the, the one on the other side is following the game, this one's not. Yeah, he's ah, and oh, that's lovely. a lovely goal Perfect. by Grant, Grant Anderson. Anderson yeah. yeah, 36th minute. And that makes it 2-0. I am really intrigued with this line over <laughs> Ah, he seems to have, he seems to have uh, basically stopped. I think he's got his fee now. <laughs> yeah. And he's Robo. Oh, 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 it's still there. Oh. Strange, uh, strange enough, uh, you know, the Gal and Robo's team have, have the best chances. But yeah. They, Here's Gibson. The legends are two. Sterling. Alan Jenkins doing his best to put, oh, and that's yeah. a lovely goal Andy by Stuff. Andy Sterling. Alan Jenkins just couldn't do enough to put him off and Andy Sterling pulls one back in the 37th minute the competitiveness of uh, Andy Sterling you can see right we're two down come on I'm going to score now yeah I thought uh, Alan Jenkins was going to do enough to block the attempt but yeah. no uh, perseverance from Andy Sterling and that uh, shows you why he scored as many as he did for us so Chris Aiken's on oh, for, yeah. the, for the Blues is that Sean Winter oh yeah it is I Winter Winter's on and Paul Woods is on and uh, Kyle Turner's out there. Kyle Turner, where is he? Kyle Turner is out there, number 15. <laughs> Andy Sterling still posing a threat. And here is Sean Winter. Ooh. Oh, and it and uh, squeezes a shot wide. Yeah. From the edge of the box. Now, I think the linesmen have swapped sides, Brian. Oh, yeah, I think the wee guys on the far side now. That's took away the entertainment value, Lawrence. Wally Gibson. No. Back here from McKenna. Oh, and oh, my goodness. Gibson going that close. That table is not far over from Wally Gibson. Wally G. Sharp to turn up. And you, you think about it, that's the, the oldest and the youngest combining yeah. there. 49-year-old Lee Sharp, 26-year-old Kyle Turner. I think Jinky Hilton is actually the younger. Yeah. The youngest one by about a week of Kyle from Kyle Turner. I don't, know, I don't know if Faz will like to, to risk Jink, Jink is, it, is in his Woods plays oh. in Robert Love. Yeah. He's going to have a shot. Oh, Ooh, and hits the crossbar. Robert Love comes oh, close to jinx. getting a third for the Whites. And another change here for the Whites. As Darrell Duffy's about to come on. Yeah, and Bobby for Robert Love. Love. Yeah. Last Piece of action. Darrell Duffy got a few goals for Sunra, particularly that 2020-2021 uh, 20, 20, season. Here's Willie Gibson. Into the box to Sean Winter. There's no flag, so he gets the shot in, and that'll be a corner for the Blues. Sean Winter <laughs> with the corner. For the, the Gal and Robo 11. Winter. It's to Stephen Bell. It's sprayed by McKenna out wide to Andy Sterling. Nope. Lee Sharp keeping an eye on him. Here's Gallagher. Grant Gallagher across to Chris Aiken. Gibson, the Blues are. have got the Whites hemmed in at the moment. Winter turns. Nope. Doherty, oh, does well, Gibson, oh, oh, oh and Aiken comes away with the ball, I thought he was going to shoot there, 
Stephen Bell oh. does. And that's a lovely Stevie finish. Stevie Bell. For Stevie Bell. Ding dong, Stevie Bell. Brings the, the Blues level, 48th minute. And uh, Brian Martin ringing the praises of Stephen Bell there. Nice finish. Yeah, it certainly was. He rolled back the time there, didn't he, Lawrence? Aye. So that's it, two apiece at Stair Park. Davy Graham. He's another one, still looks fit. Yeah, he does. He does. Now, long ball played by Henderson. Darryl Duffy, oh, oh. Yeah, Darrell Duffy. Ah, thought Bellion he was in there. Well, yeah, Stephen Bell did the business to keep him out, though. There's Willie Gibson. Oh, he's, Whoa. he's going for it. Whoa! <laughs> Hits the crossbar from, what, fully 30 yeah. yards? <laughs> What an effort from <laughs> Willie Gibson. That would have been some goal, Brian. Uh, brilliant. Brilliant stuff for Gibson. And uh, we know we've had four goals, but that's got to be one of the highlights of the game, that yeah, one. Yeah. Mark Doherty lifts it in the middle. McKenna goes off to chase. Lee Sharp's there, though. Oh, oh. Oh. And the chance <laughs> comes back to McKenna. It's Grant Gallagher. He's going to shoot. And that is well held by Aidan Russell. Willie Gibson to Grant Gallagher out on the left there. He's got Doherty behind him. Into the box. Ooh, oh, and Sean Winter's header squeezes just wide of that back post. Sean Winter, famously, he'll tell you if you want to ask him, he got a hat trick at uh, Hamden against Queen's Park when Stranraer won 4 1 yeah, and Queen's Park team featured. Andy Robertson. Andy Robertson yeah. and Lauren Shankland. Is that right? Yeah. 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 But Sean Winter was the star of the day. Left to Sharp. He's got Anderson ahead of him on the left. He'll get there. Grant Gallagher is on patrol, though. He needs to get past him. Ooh, and he almost squeezes it through to Davy Graham. Oh, Alan Jenkins. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was going to take Gibson out there. <laughs> Kyle Turner again. A nice wee back heeler to Paul Woods. They're <laughs> <laughs> so looking, so looking for the line. The line where the line's nah, been flagged it, there. It ain't it happening, guys. He stuck his flag up the ref. He's it? totally ignored them. <laughs> <laughs> 56 minutes. Eric Phillips replaces Aidan Russell. And Jinky Hilton, the youngest player in show, replaces Alan Jenkins. I've never seen big Eric playing goals. <laughs> He was always the goalkeeping coach for I us. Think, I think it's been well to get a pair of shorts to fit. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to tell him that? <laughs> no. I'm commentating up here. <laughs> <laughs> You're staying here. <laughs> Winter pokes it through to Stephen Bo uh, to Andy Stirling, rather. He has a shot, oh, and Big Eric makes Big the Eric. save. Nicely turned yeah. away by Eric Phillips from Andy Stirling. Eric Phillips straight into the thick of the action. Willie Gibson with a corner for the Blues. And it comes, oh. Scott Robertson, ooh, nearly gets headed down Murray Henderson. Murray Henderson, again, another player yeah. who's lasted the pace here. Really well. Gibson, Doherty sends it oh. in. And, and this time goes. McKenna scores David McKenna. from the back post. Nice shot home from David McKenna. He's unmarked at the back post and really couldn't miss, but nicely tucked away. And uh, meanwhile... And just, oh, yes, Ian Alton making a fierce. <laughs> oh, dear. And Greg Gallagher as well. Now, the word this, Lawrence, if Ian Aldridge Aud gets a corner, he's going to buy a shop, so we'll wait, <laughs> we'll wait and see. <laughs> now, Sharpie out to Hilton. Jinky oh. Hilton. Oh, <laughs> Greg Gallagher's taking a tumble. Jinky's still on the ball, ball. Woodsy back. Ian Aldred. Nice pass to Hilton. Aldred's in the box. Providing a threat. Woods. Oh, he's still oh, going, Paul. Oh. oh, and it goes right along the line. Here's Good Kyle Turner. Yeah. Needs to lift this back in. Oh. Oh. Still, oh, oh. still there. Was that a tug and pull? Yeah, it looked like shot it, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Magnificent. 
Grant Gallagher now McKenna in acres of space miles onside as well no question this time Scott Robertson Robo McKenna Gallagher McKenna oh, <coughs> oh. <laughs> and uh, 15 minutes off there. the post <laughs> KT Hilton out to Sharp uh, to Davy Graham rather Davy Graham cuts inside he's oh, going to have a go what, what a go Davy Graham <laughs> Davy Graham rolls back the years a wee badger <laughs> absolutely magnificent <laughs> 65 minutes into the game Davy Graham gives us a reminder of what he's capable of, and it's 3 all. Lovely yeah. finish. It's been a long time since we've seen Davy Graham scoring at Stair Park, yeah, yeah. and it's 3 all. It's all to play for. Bell out to Robertson. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Wood's trying the Saturday afternoon wrestling, or the Sunday afternoon wrestling, and Gallagher yeah. now. He can to Robertson. Winter out to Gallagher on the right. What can Gal do? Pokes it through to McKenna. McKenna oh, oh, and a good save, save by Eric, Eric Phillips. Phillips. Yeah. 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 Turned away at the near post by Phillips. <laughs> Grant Gallagher and Scott Robertson come off. The 70th minute. And they're replaced by Willie Gibson and Andy Stirling. Lovely, pausing the game there. Everybody in the benches. I see Stevie Farrell down there, Armandoni. Stevie Aiken. Play opens up for the Blues as they advance. McKenna is in a wee bit of space. And Sean oh, Winter. Sean Winter. A fine finish from the edge of the box. Yep. A nice sweep and move up the park with the Blues. And Sean Winter, 72nd minute, finishes. Didn't they give uh, Eric Phillips much a chance there, Lawrence? No, nope. and then 72 minutes, the Blues have their lead back. 4-3 for Gallon Robbo's 11. They were 2-0 down early in the game. Come back to lead 3-2. And now they're 4-3 ahead. Jinky. He's got Donald Duffy inside. Oh, oh he's got a nice ball. run from yes, Kyle, Kyle Turner. Must he's be in. for Kyle, must be KT. He's gone too <laughs> wide, he's gone too <laughs> wide. <laughs> in for Duffy! <laughs> and it's a goal, <laughs> Donald Duffy. Kyle Turner and Donald Duffy combine. <laughs> and the Whites are level again. Lovely finish. Donald Duffy, 75th minute. No, that's it. Referees. Um, we're not playing the full 80 then. No. And that's it all over. A four-all draw, Brian. Who was your man of the match? Yeah, absolutely great. I mean, logic and dentist, Lawrence, but I think I've got to go for Lee Sharp. The man's a credit to himself. Nearly 50, you know, and he turns in performance like that. Absolutely brilliant. But loads of great performance. I have to say, these were the players that impressed me. There was a lot of skill on show. Lovely goal with Davy Graham rolling back the years. But it's guys that actually are still fit enough to play yeah. like Lee Sharp for the full absolutely. 75 minutes there. Got to, got to say, Lawrence, absolutely loved it. Fantastic loved afternoon. Yep. Uh, the score is almost incidental, but for the record, Gallon Robbo's 11-4. The Stranraer Legends, four. Lots of fine goals. And there they all are. And credit to them for turning out for Gallon Robbo on a windy Sunday afternoon. Thank you for watching this testimonial with us on Stranraer FC Live. It's been thoroughly enjoyable to watch. And it's certainly the smiles on the faces of all of these players as they walk back in. And that's, that's something you don't see at the end of a football match often, both teams smiling.